imagine a car that travels at supersonic speed. Imagine being faster over land than anyone else on Earth. And imagine doing all of this to inspire the next generation in science, technology, engineering and maths. Bloodhound Supersonic Car is an engineering adventure built to break the land speed record. With a pencil shaped car powered by an engine and a rocket. At Cisco, our goal is to change the way the world lives, works, plays and learns. And when we heard about Bloodhound Supersonic Car, we just knew we had to get involved. We've held the world land speed record now for 28 years. The first car was Thrust 2, which I drove in uh, 1983, and we took a record at 633. We then followed that with the Thrust SSC project. We were the first car ever to break the sound barrier on land in 1997. And now we've got a real problem because there is a need for change. And there's a need now for um, engineering. And so what we're doing is our new project here called Bloodhound goes for Mach 1.4, 1,000 miles an hour. We had a very big problem in terms of inspiring our school children to study science and engineering. What we've discovered is that you need an inspiring project to basically drive education. And so this is where we are at the moment. We're making all the data available on this project. We have an obligation to bring the next generation from around the world closer to those important STEM subjects so that we can continue innovation at supersonic speed. We're privileged to live in very, very exciting times. Fundamentally what's happened is the old system has broken. It's almost everything has to be replaced with new technology, new ideas, new ways of doing things. It is a truly fascinating time and we're very privileged to be part of this project where we are doing exactly that. And Bloodhound's now being followed in 207 countries. There's a terrific amount of excitement for the Bloodhound project, especially as it grows internationally, with the record attempt due to take place in the Haxine Pan in the Northern Cape province of South Africa. So how does Cisco help support this small Bloodhound team? We support them in three ways. One, we're bringing the Bloodhound story to the world through video, including a channel called Cisco Bloodhound TV. This allows you to stay up to date on the progress and success of the project. Two, we're the official networking and video partner, providing our industry-leading networking infrastructure, security and collaboration products like Cisco WebEx and Meraki to help the team do more, reach more sponsors, more partners, and most of all, run their business more effectively and efficiently. Three, but most importantly, our technology allows them to reach more schools and inspire more children. And we're focusing on that commitment, not just with our technology, but by enlisting STEM ambassadors to take the Bloodhound story out to schools. We're very privileged to have Cisco as our communication partner because we have to communicate on a simply massive scale. The following of this project is becoming enormous. Now, our objective with this is to push the technology as far as it goes. And we're very delighted to be working with Cisco because we're all going to learn an awful lot from this. Join us as we support this great engineering adventure that is Bloodhound Supersonic Car.